The FBI reportedly recovered 11 sets of classified documents, including some marked top secret, while searching former President Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago home in Florida. According to the Wall Street Journal, the FBI removed 20 boxes of items from his home, including an executive pardon for a major Trump ally, Roger Stone, and information on the French President Emmanuel Macron. On Thursday, U.S. Attorney General Merrick Garland said he personally made the decision to allow the search of Trump's Florida estate has asked a federal court to release the warrant as a matter of public interest. Mike Hanner is live at the White House. Any more information about the, the contents of these highly classified documents reportedly found in, in, in Trump's possession? Well, the deadline for Trump's lawyers to respond to the Department of Justice request that the documents be unsealed has now passed. We haven't heard any formal reaction from the Trump lawyers, so now it may rest with the Florida court, which passed the warrant in the first place. Uh, but in the last few minutes, several media organizations are reporting what they say are the contents of the inventory complied by the FBI after that search at mar a -Lago. Among the inventory, according to several publications, are a number of top-secret documents uh, that deal with highly classified matters, the most highly classified uh, within the governmental system, documents that is said that should only be viewed at specific secure government sites. Uh, now, the indication, according to several publications, is that Donald Trump is being investigated under the Espionage Act because of the content of some of these documents. This is being reported. We cannot confirm independently at this particular point. However, we are hoping that the documents will be unsealed. But here is another question. Uh, the judge, if the Trump lawyers contest the matter and the judge rules that the documents can be unsealed, the judge then has to decide uh, whether all the documents are unsealed. In other words, the affidavit which the Department of Justice filed justifying the warrant, the warrant itself, and then that inventory complied by the FBI, which would reveal exactly what was taken from Trump's Mario Lago mansion. So all of these developments underway, several news organizations clearly having obtained it. I must add as well that uh, Trump himself has said uh, that he is happy for the documents to be unsealed, yet he has taken no action on this. It's very simple for Donald Trump and his lawyers to simply unseal the documents themselves. There is no need for any legal process because the documents were served on them. So that is a situation at the moment, waiting for some legal resolution, if any, waiting for the formal response of Trump's lawyers as to whether or not it's going to contest the unsealing of the documents and allow them to be made public.